What's up, what's up, what's up? It's me, Nina Ray, back again with another mukbang. And this time I have red lobster, but ironically, I have crab. Or, yeah, I have crab. But um, thank you for coming to my page, Two Lots of Control. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button down below and hit that like button if you like red lobster. And comment down below and tell me what you go to red lobster and get. Probably not this like me. I don't know. This is such a weird. I didn't even think about this until I got eating. But um, I do want to tell you what I have. And I just remembered I got something else. So <laughs> I have some snow, Alaskan snow crab legs. I got um, a pound and a half. So it's like three clusters, I think. Um, some melted butter. I think it's still melted, I hope. Um, a bloated baked potato, which I'm going to put all the stuff in now. Some broccoli, which I'm not going to show you because it's going to blend in back here. And then a side salad, same thing. And, of course, I completely forgot I had these because I went to Red Lobster. Oh, this is a better thumbnail than the one I had because I forgot. Uh, let's see if we can straighten that out a little bit more. Alright, so, of course, they sent Cheddar Bay Biscuits. I didn't even think about it, because on the menu, I ordered these online, and online, it's an option to order them, so I just was like, oh, forget. Mm. Oh. That's so good. Mm. I'm getting four. I'm getting those down here. I'm getting those down here. I'm going to save the other two. I'm so happy I have those. Mm. 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 Oh my god. Ooh. Oh, that was so good. <laughs> I'm just like, I'm so happy I looked over in the bag and saw those. Mm. Oh, here's that just fell. Mm. It does not want to be eaten. Oh, okay. So let me load my potato. So there's already cheese in it. I have some sour cream. I thought I had chives. Chives. And I asked for bacon too, but I don't think they had any. Or I left it in the bag. But I don't think I saw any earlier. Alright, so the mic is in place. Do do do. Okay. My lighting looks crazy to me. I don't know. I want my face more to look up. I wonder can I like see my sword up without like destroying the way my crap looks like. Oh I think that's exactly what I'm looking for. Uh, necklace out. Okay. Let me put this down. Wait, can you my jewelry? Mm, no, I think I'm fine. I do need a watch. This broccoli is there. It has like some kind of seasoning on it. That is still pretty basic. Mm. But they did cook it just right. That was perfect. But <clears throat> thank you for those of you who have subscribed. Thank you for those of you who are liking my videos. I really appreciate it. Also, please, always, I look for feedback. I really enjoy it. Mm. Let me know what you think. Let me know what food you think I should eat next. Comment down below and let me know. But these crab legs don't look anything different. And the ones I get at Sam's Club, they were just convenient. And price wise, they were better priced. Mm. 
Mm. I love side salads, but I put so much ranch on them. Like, they probably aren't even good salads anymore. <laughs> oh, I can probably show this after. I mix it all up because it's going to be covered in ranch. So I don't want to be bringing it anymore. Because they definitely give me extra ranch. The salad is not even big enough for one ranch. But I like salad dressing. I don't like salad, to be honest. Actually, I do. I take that back. I do like salad, but I love salad dressing. I love it. I just got plain ranch on it. And it's like a lettuce, or like a romaine. Oh, sorry, I ranch on me. It's like a romaine, um, arugula, I guess, and grape tomatoes with red onions and uh, cheese. And that's it. I thought there would be croutons. I should have went and got some croutons because I know I have those in my cabinet. I love croutons. Oh, it is like covered in ranch. It's still green though. <clears throat> okay. So, that's my salad. That looks ridiculous. My neck crack for that one. That's pretty plain butter. I tried it though. Oh, but these are meatier than the ones from Sam's Club. And they look nicer. Alright, so today. <clears throat> well, when I'm filming this, it is the 28th, so we're like three days away from the new year. <laughs> is anybody sudden or thinking about their new year's resolution? If so... What is it? Or did you have one last year? Because I'm... Um, hmm. Alright, I'm going to eat a little bit more than I'm going to talk. Cause I keep covering up my face like in that Burger King video. I'm going to get up close and light it inside. Oh, that was, I was trying to get the whole thing out. Mm, but, it is a little meatier than that Sam's Club one. Butter all over my potatoes. That's good, though. This crab does have some good taste. Like, it is really good. Oh. 
Oh, excuse me. Okay, so yesterday, I filmed my Burger King mukbang. And I think I'm going to post it today. Hopefully, along with this one. I'm not doing anything else. Does not work. Well, it does. But it doesn't have numbers. I just looked at this. So I don't know. It depends on which way you wear it, I guess. Oh, it's okay. Oh, but they just all keep breaking. Mm. Oh, it's still like a good piece. Oh, that other piece about to get small. Mm. And it's so good. So shout out to their lobster. I ordered this on Grubhub. And so, <laughs> they had like you pick two of sides, two sides. <clears throat> and your options were like broccoli, rice, french fries, mashed potatoes, baked potato, baked potato with butter, and then baked potato with sour cream. And the last baked potato with sour cream and butter. And there was no option for loaded. So I just typed that in the special instruction and they got it together for me and they were very nice about it. So thank you to Red Lobster. Even though I was just complaining about bacon. But shout out Red Lobster. And I am going to eat all this potato. I love potatoes and the skin is really good for you. say the word like claw or like claw claw I'll have to say it later it looks like like popping water all over my face and it's gross I keep missing them, like throwing them against the wall. I didn't finish that one. Those little ones are too hard. I already just skipped them. Mm. But I didn't order anything else. Red Lobster is so disappointing to me every single time. I am, like, not, like, complaining. It's not how I am. <laughs> but maybe it's just the one by my house, but I feel like Red Lobster is subpar. Where your crab legs? You are great. So shout out to Red Lobster having a really good crab. Yeah, their crab is bomb. I didn't get dessert because they only had two desserts. I would say that's so weird. If they only two, it's just not worth that. 
So they were just like, all right, just throw them in the menu. Just give them something else to get. And that's, nah, that's too sketchy. They probably something just frozen. <clears throat> and crab legs are so much better. I feel like when you don't have to go through the trouble of boiling and defrosting and going to the different places to go get them, the different stuff you want. They're just so much better. Like, the convenience is awesome. Yeah, I got this book. But, anyway, I think about this all the time, especially, like, when I order food or anything, like, delivery, or specifically, like, via Uber Eats, Postmates, or Grubhub. I always think, like, this is so freaking, like, futuristic. At least we're, like... Like, people in my generation, I think little kids think this is just how life works. Well, this is, because this is just how their life works, but I think it is. It's so futuristic, because I remember it used to be, like, um, I remember when I was younger, on social media, everybody used to post, I wish McDonald's had delivery. I wish McDonald's had delivery. In the age of, like, Postmates, all those things. Oh, they're so good. Um, you can just like go on your phone and click, 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 and you get food. Somebody brings it to your door. Like, I think that's so crazy. Like, we're not far from like a movie like Wally. -E. <laughs> I say that all the time, and nobody likes that, but I think so. Like, I literally do not have to leave my house for anything if I don't choose to. Amazon will bring everything I need to my house. Like Kroger, still Kroger, like grocery stores. Walmart even does it. They deliver groceries straight to your house. So you never have to leave your house anymore. That's so convenient. And like you can get, there's so many jobs like available from home. And then under a country, like, um, <clears throat> I work in, um, I work with kids, and to make extra money, I was looking for jobs that require, like, teaching licenses or whatever. And you can literally teach children in other countries English online. That's crazy. So essentially, you could live in seclusion in your home. That amazes me. And some people actually live that life. Some people never leave their homes. But then, if there's like a crazy power outage, then you're forced to leave your home. Like... <laughs> I remember back in, like, I want to say November, yeah, we had a crazy, like, winter blizzard where there was ice and stuff everywhere, and all of our power went out. Like, my power was out for the whole day. Like, I just, like, could not come home. It was really cold, so I just stayed with my mom for the day. And then, once the power came back on, the Wi-Fi was out. <laughs> Thank God for, like, electronics. We had a hot spot. And that's the only thing that got me through, like, the week of no Wi-Fi. But 
I also think that's crazy because I'm so dramatic. Mm. But, like, people live without Wi-Fi all the time. I know, like, I go over people's houses and they don't have Wi-Fi at all. That's nuts to me. But people do it. Oh my god that is so good like even without the butter i was i felt like i thought the butter had all that taste oh crap mm. all right now i'm being ridiculous <laughs> these garbages are gonna be everywhere in my house Oh gosh, now I'm just really down to claws and knuckles. Well, I've been doing a good job of finishing my seafood. All right, let me finish everything else, and then I won't feel as bad if I finish. Don't finish that. I told you guys. Mm. I'm keeping these videos short. But I'm going to sign out. But like always, I'm going to keep eating. But um, this week, I am going to do, not this week, probably next week. It's like Sunday or Saturday. I don't know what it is. But um, I am going to do a seafood boil with Be Love sauce and some QDQ sauce. But until then, there will be a few more, um, I don't know what to call them, other food mukbangs, sorry, I was getting really carried away with that under the table. Uh, there'll be other food mukbangs, and so stay tuned, make sure you hit that subscribe button down below, go ahead and like this video, and also tell me what you like from my last year. Oh, and your new, new Year's resolution, whether it be the one you made last year or the one you plan on starting for the new coming up year. And let me know if you kept that one from last year. Bye.